Hey, buddy. What's wrong? Oh, I got you. Yeah, it's okay. We're good. Who's that handsome fellow, huh? <laughs> hey, you like these guys, huh? <laughs> they got some crazy hair. What's up, you little goobers? Hey, thanks for doing the dishes. You can thank me by putting on some music. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. How about some tunes? <laughs> ah, you want a boogie, huh? Yeah, I love this song. Your mom is very easy to please. I'm with you. My bar is very low. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Ooh, look at those moves. These moves? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, look at mama go. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. This is kind of working on me. You're weird. I'm aware. Okay. Okay, <laughs> you're distracting me. No. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Go. Okay. <laughs> oh, hey. I think I left Ollie outside. You mind bringing him back in? 
Yeah, sure thing. You want some fresh air? stories to tell you when you're older <sighs> much older <sighs> I don't even know where to begin But we should go check on Mama. <clears throat> I'm going to go hang up the laundry. You got that? Yeah, I got it. Does he need his jacket? No, he's fine. More? You can tell me to stop. Should I stop? Enough. Seriously. <laughs> you want to pet him? Here. Uh. All right. There you go. Oh, oh, oh. Gentle, gentle, gentle. Just like that. There you go. Yeah. Hey. Hey. I'll take him. Can you get the sheep into the barn? Oh, I got him. I can do it. Yeah? Yeah. Why don't you rest it up? <laughs> okay. Here. Come on. Put you in there. Don't stay out too long. We still need the bath. I'm like the herding master. Listen up, sheep. Your dinner awaits you in the barn, so come on. Snowy, barn time. Daisy, head on in. Wow, that's a lot of sheep. How many do you think that is? One, two, better stop, because I'm getting sleepy. Eugene. Hey, hey, inside, inside. Todd, move it or lose it. <sighs> we definitely have way too many sheep. Hey, 
What do you say we eat some of them? Tasty snack. You warm enough, buddy? Just a few more. I got one for you. What's the quietest animal on a farm? A sheep. When you're older, you're gonna have a deep appreciation for these jokes. Okay, one more. What do you get when you cross an angry sheep and a mad cow? An animal that's in a bad mood. <laughs> yeah, mama likes that one too. Okay, guys, we'll see you tomorrow. Hey, how'd you get out? Come on, little dude. Good. Haven't had a, any excitement in a while. you. Who are you here with? Hey, where you been? Hunting. Took a little longer than I thought. Who's here? Uh, just come inside. Ow. <laughs> Ow. Well, that's quite Ow. a rip you got there. Hey, Tommy. There you are. Here, let me take it. Come here, bud. Oh, oh, yeah. Go. Here. Oh, I got it. I got it. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
Good to see you. Mm, you too. <laughs> He's getting heavy. No, he's <laughs> just a big ball of muscle. Hmm? <laughs> Town's good? Maria good? Oh, she's fine. We, uh... We're taking some time apart. Hmm. Sorry. Nah. We talked about it a lot, and, uh... Yeah, that's what we both want, so... <clears throat> okay. Oh. Come sit. I got something to show you. So I've been putting out feelers for months now. And this new guy heard my story. He told me about a woman that he traded with while he was moving through California. Described her as built like an ox, traveling with a kid with scars across his face. He said they're living along this coast in a beach sailboat right here. That's got to be her. We're done with that, so. I'm sorry. <clears throat> well, <laughs> I can't go. Reckon it's easy. Forget about her. You sitting all comfy way out here? Hey. I'll make her pay. Tommy. That's what you said when we got back to Jackson. Tommy. What a joke. Can you take him, please? Yeah. What was that? Nothing. God damn it, Tommy. You know what we've been... I'll say it. She made me a promise. I don't fucking care. I know you don't, dear. That's your goddamn problem.
about my patrols. Don't go here, don't go there. It's funny how involved he gets whenever you're scheduled to go out. Yeah. She's, uh, she's put on quite the show. I give you guys two weeks until you're back together. Not gonna happen. She, uh, say something to you? Make it one week. Ellie! Hey! What took you so long? Well, I'm here, aren't I? Dina? Jesse? Come on. Hey, don't forget, we're heading out early, so get some rest. Yes, sir. You're such a dick. Come on. Why don't you start with me? Okay, I have a very serious question for you. How bad do I smell? Like a hot pile of garbage. Oh, okay. Oh, how about that? Gross. <laughs> you love it. Every guy in this room is staring at you right now. Maybe they're staring at you. Or not. Maybe they're jealous of you. I'm just a girl, not a threat. Family event. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Remember next time there's kids around. Yeah, like you're setting such a great example. Oh, just what this town needs. Another loudmouth dyke. The fuck did you just say? Ellie, hey. Ellie, don't. Get the hell out of here. Get your hands off me. Hey! Enough. For a walk. What about them? You worry about yourself. Let's get you some fresh air. You all right, kiddo? What is wrong with you? He had no right. And you do? I don't need your fucking help, Joel. Right. Hey. Hey. Man, it's been a while since he slept this long, huh? He had a day. Yeah. He's fine. Go back to bed. We'll talk about it in the morning, okay? I have to finish it.
You don't owe Tommy anything. I don't sleep. I don't eat. I'm... I'm not like you, Dina. What? You think this is easy? For you and for him, I deal with it. I love you. Prove it. Stay. I can't. So what? I'm just supposed to, to sit here and wait for you? For God knows how long, just thinking you're fucking dead the entire time? I don't plan on dying. Yeah, well, neither did Jesse. Or Joel. Hey, stop. Hey. Hey. Come on. We've got a family. She doesn't get to be more important than that. No. I'm not going to do this again. That's up to you. Straight a week ago. I can't believe you traded a pistol for this. It's elite. No way that guy saw fireflies over here. Stop. I feel good about this. Well, I don't. Come on. Twenty-four ten. It's not going to be on that side. It's all evens. 24.09. If the fireflies are still out there. Yeah. What do you think they're up to? I don't know. The goal was always to restore society. I mean, there's all sorts of ways to go about it. Seems like a strange place to find a resistance group. We had all sorts of outposts. Big and small. Best way to hide from the army. Something's out there. To our left, demon. Oh, <laughs> 
All quiet now. Good. I knew something was out there. Yes, you did. Keep your guard up. Let's go back to finding that house. 2425. That a boy. What if we don't find them here? Assuming all the leaves dry up, what would you like to do? I don't know. Leave this place? Okay. And where would we go? West. See what's out there. It's nothing but ocean. And past it? Other countries, I guess. You want to do that? Why not? Good question. That's where graffiti. Does that mean fireflies? No. Nothing I recognize, at least. Just a sec. What do you want to do for dinner tonight? We've got those lobsters I caught yesterday. Twenty-four seventeen. Getting warmer. Oh, I hope not. I'm sweating already. You're such a goober. What? Nothing. This place looks abandoned, like all the other houses. Keep searching. Hmm. 2425 Constance. This is the place. Okay, but there's nothing here. We don't know that yet. Painted the indoors to look like the outdoors, but plants don't look like that. It's more like a a child's dream version of the outdoors. In the old world, it'd be common for them to decorate kids' rooms like this. My dad painted a, a colorful jungle for me. Oh. Yara would have loved that. I bet she would have. Maybe there's another way in. Are you being positive? I'm trying to be helpful. You're always helpful.
everything's empty. Yeah. That's the vibe I'm getting. Remember the last time we were in a pool? Oh, you mean when we were plummeting to our doom? Yeah, I have a small recollection of it. If it makes you feel better, I also thought we were gonna die. Nope. Lev, I think we're done here. No, wait. You find something? Scratches. <laughs> Scooch. Unfortunately, I have to agree with you. Pretty nice barracks, all things considered. Guess they've got solar. Is this frequency currently in use? This is... Do you see a call sign anywhere? Oh, a what? It's a short list of numbers and letters. Hmm. Okay. This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Can anyone hear me? Standing by. Is anyone out there? What's this? Those are frequencies. Is this frequency currently in use? This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Is anyone out there? Are these other Firefly outposts? I don't know. Can anyone hear me? Hello? Is this frequency currently in use? This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Hello. Hello. Is this frequency currently in use? Hello, this is Abby from Santa Barbara. Can anyone hear me? If anyone can hear me, please reply. Please answer. Hi, Abby. We got a clear signal on you. Where in Santa Barbara are you calling from? Um, 24, 25 Constance. Uh, we got a tip about a base, but there's no one here. We're looking for fireflies. I'm a, I'm a firefly. Where were you stationed? I was part of the Salt Lake outpost. Who ran that facility? Dr. Jerry Anderson. He was my dad. Well, how about that? We pulled everyone 
back from the satellite stations and brought them back here to home base. How many of you are there? We're about 200 strong now, with a few more every month. Oh, no, right. You're about to get two more. How do we find you? Get to Catalina Island. Approach the large domed building in Avalon. We'll find you. Okay. Okay, we'll see you soon. Over and out. Looking forward to it. Good luck, Abby from Santa Barbara. Over and out. Come on, let's get back to the sailboat. Okay, fine. You were right. Uh, what was that? Why do you make me repeat whenever I'm wrong? Because it makes me feel better. And because it happens so rarely. you go from here? Two, four, two, five, Constance. Yeah, that's gotta be it. 